Norway's justice minister has also been defending the country's penal system amid criticisms there should be tougher sentences for such serious crimes. There have been calls for Breivik to face crimes against humanity charges, which would add an extra eight years to the 21 years in jail he's currently facing. Stoltenbergen said there will be changes, of course, but the government has been very clear that Norway is going to be recognized as an open and free democracy, as it is. Others in Oslo appear equally determined that the actions of one man will not change their way of life. Not looking forward to this. <laughs> but I'll make it. He's not going to control my life. I'm a little bit afraid. I'm working very close by to the government building where it happened. So uh, I keep hearing the explosion in my head. I don't think there really is a punishment that matches the cruelty and evil of this man. Uh, we have the laws, we have the regime for this and it's up to the courts to really decide this punishment.